Do you notice at yourself this tendency of pouring another glass of wine on a Tuesday even though you promise to yourself that you'll drink tea this evening or maybe you eat a whole bucket of KFC in the middle of the night or maybe you watch movies until late even though you have work or an important exam the next day do you resonate with these questions with you with this situation basically what are these are the manifestation of our inner rebel and i want you to know that we all have this we all have this archetype of inner rebel in our, in ourselves it's the, um, the one that it's always different that wants to do exactly the opposite but it's in the same time the one that's unique and that's special and it's a beautiful energy that we can work with we can have this energy to support us in being creative in being rebel but in the sense of questioning whatever happens in our society with the rules in our culture with being married at 30 years old or you know having a certain type of job that will bring you money this is an energy that can help us to invent new things to reinvent old um, cycles that are keep going on in our society and our culture so it's a good energy if you know how to hone it but what usually happens is that first of all we need to be aware of these patterns we need to be aware that we have this energy inside of us that try to be exactly the opposite that we have like two opposite parts inside of our soul and then we need to transform this energy because this rebel in a rebel is an energy that is inside of us so how can we work with this energy first of all we need to bring some attention to this part like any other part of ourselves um, like the masculine the feminine the good and bad the good girl the bad girl we need to uh, to spend some time a little bit like a rebel let's take uh, an adolescent a teenager right he yells he tries to you know break things in the house or to uh, speak out loud what does that adolescent that teenager wants in his heart he wants to be listened to he wants to be cared for he wants to receive extra attention it's exactly the same how we would work with our inner rebel we need to give give him give this part a little attention a little care from from our side and um, we can do this uh, in different uh, like we can journal with it we can take a picture from our uh, teenage years and talk with with that version of ourselves uh, we can um, plan a day per week where you can do things like breaking things in a controllable way or staying until late or um, cheat day to eat whenever whatever you want per week and um, or you can um, join Jose and I to uh, transformative workshop on Thursday uh, on the 12th of August for the International Youth Day we thought that this would be a really nice workshop for us to to work with this rebel rebelled energy and to transform it into a friendly energy that can help us to you know break old patterns create new beautiful things in our lives and uh, you know break society rules in a good way and invent new things that will like raise consciousness uh, for all humans because it's not only by um, our subjective per perspective uh, when we heal a part of ourselves we heal our humanity and we heal our um, descendants as well we heal the future generation that will come so healing it's a great uh, gift and also a great responsibility and we can all work together on this having a group where you can release uh, these patterns and these emotions um, and having like eight practical tools that will help you to uh, hone this energy uh, can be really healing and 
uh, you will have a lifetime access to these practices um, you will receive the recording after the workshop you will have two teachers myself and jose i will guide a hypnosis and a meditation so i'll use my hypnotherapy experience to help you access that teenager part of yourself that's against things to help you to transform it into a really uh, friendly um, part of yourself and Jose will do six body practices that will help you to break things in an imaginary way and to break out of your patterns and of limitations and uh, you know every time like you want to pour a glass of wine and on Tuesday to celebrate it and not to feel guilty about it and um, you can find the link in my bio for more details and it would be really nice to have you with us in this really really transformative workshop and um, I wish you a really deep healing uh, ahead <music>